ironic this guy just pulled up ridge runner i was thinking about starting one called grid jumper grid jumper would be like more for a big city around here ridge runner is about perfect what you think all right i got the need for speed folks i also have the need for silence <laughs> there's nothing i can do the aluminum on the bottom broke nothing i can do about putting a muffler in there sunrise honda rogers arkansas i believe it's still rogers don't quote me on that there it is folks there it is the need for speed although i don't want to youtube's monkey see monkey do it's all social media is it's dangerous right the old spiel i spit out i recommend using a car but uh there it is super dangerous the ultimate delivery machine it's lightweight it's small it's a 300 so it has some kick to it i can go on the interstate honda cb 300r i didn't say that yet anti-lock brakes not bad i hopefully they're not as annoying as a big vehicle i can't stand anti-lock brakes i don't know what kind of driver would like them but i suppose they're good maybe somehow for the masses but uh <laughs> it almost cost me my life in the analog brake car i drove once twice twice in the same car analog brakes i didn't stop i wanted to stop they wouldn't let me stop so uh i went flying off the road with analog brakes so keep that in mind but anyways there it is i have to get used to the uh, analog brakes apparently so i have to mental note mental note stay away from that issue <laughs> be prepared for that and uh lightweight quick it's not much heavier than my scooter it's just over 300 pounds which is light nimble it's built for traffic and uh basically i've picked this bike because it's the ultimate delivery machine okay so i'm interested to know how many of my viewers out there are actively delivering right now at the start of the video, you saw that Ridge Runner courier service. I'm kicking around, maybe trying to start an app of some sorts like that. I just want to know. This is just a thought. What you see here is Kooky Cookie with the little pig. I live in a university town, uh, home of the, the Razorbacks. They call them the hogs. So this is just an idea. I And I made this little website here. It's not complete, but I'll have this up and running in a couple of weeks. You can go check it out right now. It's kookycookie.net and uh it's k-o-o-k-y cookie.net and i just got some ideas here obviously these are all chocolate chip pictures but uh, this I'm just this is an idea i just put it on the on the board i'm on my sketch pad here but this this site is operational but please don't buy anything <laughs> so i'm kicking around a few different ideas and uh just the cookie cookie right the hogs they call them the hogs they call them call them the pigs so like uh, down here, I have uh, this, you know, this is something, something I might try, right? Just go down to the strip during a, after the game or on the weekend. And like I got, have you ever heard them call the Razorbacks? They go, woo, pig, suey, Razorback. So down here, I got woo, pig, pooey. I was thinking like a big triple or double chocolate, like 14 inch cookie cake, right? Woo, big, pooey. <laughs> so cookie, cookie. And I, I just got some ideas here, hog drops, one maybe shaped like a football. I was thinking sleepy times, uh, maybe, I don't know, I was thinking make, maybe like a uh, melatonin chewy in the middle after it's cooked. <laughs> I don't know. I don't want to get sued. So I'm just kicking stuff, stuff around. But like uh, I've been testing out crushed candy cookies, like crushing uh, frozen Jolly Rancher hard candies and then cooking that on top of the cookie. And so I'm just trying some stuff out here, trying to trying to uh, come up with a decent product. But anyways, I just want to know how many people out there might be interested in trying to get that going with me. And uh, this is, you know, it'll be down the road. Just like I say, this is just a, basically a sketch. Although the site is active, if you want to go have a look at it, Cookie Cookie.
anyways, let me know. Let me know because uh, there's good money in it if you do it the right way. And I've noticed cookies are super popular now. Where I live in Arkansas, they have laws set up to where it's perfectly legal for you to cook and sell baked goods right out of your your dwelling. You don't have to have a health inspector or anything. So I've looked at that. And now that might be different where you guys live. But one idea I was thinking is maybe I could make a bunch of this and freeze it and ship it. And, you know, if, this, if an app gets going. But yeah, it's just it's, I got lots of ideas. But just just for starters, let me know how many people might be interested in delivering. And uh, let me know in the comment section if you are delivering, if you like it and are you making good money and just let me know in the comment section any ideas you got. And uh, all right, let me yammer some more. Later. Hope you enjoyed it. Thanks. Bye.